you know. Oh. oh. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Sunset with GT. Mm. Cheers. Wow. 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 Yeah, so suck it. <laughs> <laughs> GT kombucha. Dude, Tamaki, you know what we should do? What? You should try GT Dave's kombucha. Dude, we totally should. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> What's poppin' guys? Welcome back to another drink taste test with me and my guy Tomoki. What's up? This is insane! <laughs> Tomoki, what do we have in front of us today? We have none other than GT Dave aka Kombucha King's signature kombucha drinks. Both Tomoki and I were big fans of Koiko and the World Village, so huge shout out to you guys for inspiring us to make this video, this taste test, and essentially, Tomika and I, two of our favorite videos from Cody Co. and Miller are the Kombucha King and Visiting the Kombucha Lair. I was just watching them randomly, and I realized, man, GT Dave is a legend, yet we have never really tried his products before. So, you know, I was strolling around at Whole Foods, and boom, these caught my attention. GT Dave's Kombucha, these are his kombucha. This is what he's known for. This is why Cody Co. and Noah Miller made their reaction video to GD Day because of these. I'm kind of surprised that Cody Co. and Noah Miller did never try this. So did they never try? I don't think they I, ever I had any kombucha. Tried, yeah, they never tried GT's kombucha. Yeah. So that's where we come in play. We're gonna be trying GT Dave's kombucha for the first time to see if it's good, to see if it's worthy of your attention for you to try them. These are in order of what we're most excited yep. for. These two are what we're most excited for. The first one is Guava Goddess, the kombucha base and guava puree. The second one is Watermelon Wonder, the same kombucha base with watermelon and cherry juice. Mm -hmm. And then we got the trilogy, which is kombucha base, lemon, ginger, raspberry. And then we got the Mystic Mango. That's what I'm excited for. It's the mango puree. And I am a fan of mango. Mango is my top two favorite fruits Ooh. besides strawberry. So that's why it's last. We want to save the best for last. Before we start, once again, thank you, Cody Co, Noah Miller, GT Dave. Y'all are legends. We love you guys so much. And we have high expectations for this GT Dave kombucha taste test. We're going to be brutally honest with you guys. Yep. If it's good, it's good. If it's great, it's great. If it's bad, it's not going to be bad because we know GT Dave, you know? Yep. It has to be good. He cured cancer. Let's get into it. <laughs> First Let's one. Let's get into it. POV pour right here. I would have to say, so far right off the bat, the guava has a stunning color. Wow, and look at the fizz, guys. Just this spill is it natural from a bubbly drink from the fermentation, the kombucha culture. Let's do a smell test first. It smells fermented. <laughs> I've smells never really smelled kombucha before, so. I have tried guava before, and this smells quite like guava. what you would expect with guava. And it's a red guava. Typically, guavas are green on the outside, white on the inside, but there's also some guavas where the inside is pink, reddish, and that's what I think this is. Cheers. That's good. That's, that's really refreshing. refreshing. Yeah. I exactly what I was going to say. Yeah. It's a slightly tangy. It's not super mm. sweet. I feel the health. Yeah. The health is, like is... My mouth is salivating. I'm really impressed by the fizz because it tastes similar to a sparkling beverage. I'm going to go in for a little bit more. I'm very intrigued by kombucha and I think GT Dave is a creator of kombucha for people to drink like these bottle kombuchas. I think he's the founder. He created this. It's a uh, natural, yeah. natural sugars. So and it's organic. I'm thoroughly impressed by this drink so far. It's so light, not too sweet. Only 16 grams of sugar per the bottle. The whole bottle. Yeah. I mean insane. that's impressive. We were just filming a random sprite or fake sprite I mean, we weren't video. just filming it. Yeah, we weren't just filming it. Like about it. a month ago, yeah. we were filming yeah. it. But yeah, but that had like. 40 grams of sugar for just one and a half cups. Yeah, so even less than this, and like that's four or five times the amount of sugar in GT Dave's kombucha. No, it's great stuff. Nice. That's good. Round of applause, <laughs> GT Dave. So far, the first one. Bussin. Bussin. I think I'm going to drink this like literally next time I go to Whole Foods or a grocery store. I spot this. Well, let's see. Let's see about the other one. Okay, Maybe. Yeah, Maybe I, I might be a little bit too excited, but let's continue on with. The next one, which is Watermelon Wonder. This one I'm not too excited mm -hmm. for, but definitely worth yeah. trying. Same thing for me. I would say my experience with watermelon flavored candy drinks. It's always been watered down. Yeah, it has never exceeded my expectations. GT Dave, who knows? Could he surprise us today with this one? And oh, look at that face, guys. Did you hear it? Right on. Let's get a boys one out. 
What's really impressive is the fizz. Tip this, guys. Warm and wonder. Cheers. Cheers. It's surprisingly good considering how many drinks are so watered down. Yeah. Out of all the watermelon drinks yeah. that I've had in my life, this is definitely like top two or three. You also really taste the cherry juice. Oh, that's where the yeah. flavor is actually. I was wondering. In fact, I would say the cherry flavor kind of overtakes the watermelon. Flavor. It does. There's not mm -hmm. that a whole lot of watermelon. Yeah. Going. I would prefer the Guava Goddess over the Watermelon Wonder. Yeah. But I'm not taking away from the Watermelon Wonder. If you're a fan of watermelon or cherry flavored drinks, you go for this. Yeah. You're going to enjoy it yeah, totally. Yeah, exactly. Next up, we have Trilogy, a trio of raspberry, lemon, and ginger. So far for the first two drinks, I'm vibing with them. GT, you're creating something revolutionary. I'm really enjoying this experience. Let's go with the Trilogy. The reason why I'm shaking it is because there's mm -hmm. also like... Yeah, the kombucha culture at the bottom. I feel like this one is if... Oh, you see that? Guys, Guys, wow. you can vape that. <laughs> Alright, guys. This is the busiest of them all. Quick pour. Hear that guys? Very nice stuff over here, GT Dave. Oh yeah. One of my favorite things so far about GT Dave is the fizz is just right in the sense that I can drink this whole shot glass. You know no, when you drink like yeah when you drink fizz that is too powerful, it hurts your throat mm. and your insides. This doesn't. This is like a light tingly sensation. Let's give Troji a go. Cheers. There's more of a kombucha flavor to it. Like yeah. you can tell that it's fermented. The ginger really shines bright. This mm -hmm, one, the ginger mm -hmm, and lemon, mm -hmm. because it's not as sweet as the rest. No. Only 12 grams of sugar in this bottle. It, it tastes like when your mom makes you ginger tea with lemon yeah. when you're sick. Mm -hmm. It tastes like that, but in more little, of a fizzy, yeah. refreshing fruity because taste. of the raspberry. So far, the trilogy would be second place on my scale. I would say so yeah. too, yeah. The Maybe guava is definitely me. up there. The guava yeah. is definitely the best so far, but the creme de la creme. The creme de la creme. Mango. Mango. Guys, mango is the love of my life. After these three flavors so far, I would already recommend you guys to try out GT Dave's Kombucha at your nearest grocery store. Without a question, look at the bottles. They look very stylish. And it's glass. Very beautiful. It's so glass. you can reuse this. Yeah. And it's no wonder Noel Muller and Kelly Co. decided to review GT Dave's video and make this a whole series because this right here is a quality, quality drink. Now, Oh, Ooh. you know. Oh, oh. Guys. <laughs> guys. Wow. That's this one's you know. excited to come out of the yeah. bottle. Whoa. Oh. This is exciting stuff here. Guys. Guys. Sip of this. this Give one's... us a second. Let's clean up the mess. Room. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the kombucha though. It's it's bubbling. That's crazy stuff, guys. Guys, crazy stoked for GT this one. GT Dave's kombucha is no joke. It's lively. It's living. It's alive, actually. Yeah. That's why I think GT's brand is GT's Living Foods. Ah, oh, it's because he puts a little bit of his body in each one. Because it's alive. <laughs> Quick pour. Quick pour, guys. Oh, did you see that? Oh, yeah. The color is just beautiful. He dropped the camera and covered in GT Dave. <laughs> Last drink here. Guys. Guys. Guys, quick sip of this. Quick sip of the mango. Cheers. Yeah, I mean. That's the winner, guys. Yeah, it's right that, there. It's right there. It's at the, the top. The mango flavor is not bang in your face. It kind of treads water a bit. You taste it at the very end. I would give the mango the first place out of the four kombuchas we've tried right here. Basically, this is our ranking. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The Water Mystic Mountains. Mango first, then the Guava Goddess, then the Trilogy, then the Watermelon Wonder. I would drink all of these four again. I would. I would uh, definitely buy these two yeah. for sure. If I was at the grocery store and I saw these four, these two would be instant buys. If yeah. I was feeling a bit more on the healthy side, I would get the Trilogy. And the Watermelon Wonder, I'd get it if someone is a fan of watermelon or cherry. Overall, thoroughly impressed with GT Day's Kombucha. Now, should we do something that might be frowned upon? Are we going to mix it? Great minds thinking like guys. Mix it all. GT Dave, we're helping you out here. Yeah, we're making another this is a new kombucha. Here we go. I'm excited for this one. <laughs> we're gonna go to the brim. I'm sure when GT Dave makes these kombucha, he's experimenting, you know? And you think GT Dave does this at home too? He's like, what? I feel like he does this. Who knows? Maybe this is the new oh, flavor for GT. So far, the color is quite inspiring. It looks like when you did yeah. the Sour Patch Kids drinks. 
<laughs> Flashback. Okay, Sour Patch Kids soda. Wow, holy, wow. I have no words to explain how good this is. End of flashback. I would say the color is like Tropical Punch. Yeah. Let's give this a name. Oh, I know. Tropical Sunset. Oh, I was thinking GT Juice, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sunset with GT. Mm. Cheers. Cheers. Wow. 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 <laughs> That's this is actually insane. good. I have never tasted this flavor in my mouth before, guys. No one, I don't think anyone ever has. <laughs> this is next level, top notch. Guys, I think we just made something happen. GT Dave. GT Dave. In the event you're watching this, make this. We gave you a name already. A drink, yeah. Sunset with Dave. A special summer drink, limited edition. Just give us a call or DM Tomoki on Instagram at tomoki.okamura. Please give us a cut of a, a yeah. royalty. Or comment down below if you like this video or if you want to collab with us or any of the above. Cody hey, Co. Hey, no, if like, you want to let us into your <laughs> layer. Yeah, we will be like the Walmart version of Cody Co. and Noel Miller. We're the, uh... <laughs> We're the, like the no-name brand. Yeah, the Choose Up brand. Yeah, the Choose Up brand. Overall, I really, really enjoyed GT Dave's kombucha. Yeah, I would buy these two for sure. Guava, Goddess, Mystic Mango. When I was at Whole Foods, it's a lot more, more flavors. I think there's like grape, pineapple, blueberry, green juice one. Maybe we might do like a part two of trying GT Dave's kombucha for the first time. If this one bangs. Combining if all of GT Dave's kombucha. Off. Exactly. Stay tuned. Thank you guys so much for watching me on the case as you Tomoki and I were just out here living life, having fun, making these fun food or drink videos. We really hope you guys enjoy them. And as always, we'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Peace. Good stuff. Good stuff. <laughs> I'll sleep with Videos every Sunday. And guys, don't forget to live a spicy life. That's like the perfect ending. We got five videos. Yeah, and we got meeting with your parents. <laughs> <laughs>